Astronauts are some of the most inspiring people in the world. We've all wanted to become an astronaut at one point or another. But beyond the glitz and glamour of space life in the media, there are some immense difficulties that are faced by astronauts every day. In this video, we'll be going through what life is really like on the International Space Station. So let's begin. Who's on the International Space Station? The International Space Station is a collaboration between the national space agencies of the United States, Russia, Japan, the European Union, and Canada. It's considered one of the most ambitious space projects of all time and currently is populated by 244 astronauts from 19 different countries. Astronauts on the International Space Station have to go through rigorous training in order to be ready to withstand the conditions and lifestyle changes they have to face on the ISS. Besides simply physical training, astronaut candidates also have to go through intense studies that will make a PhD look like a piece of cake in order to qualify for a spaceflight. They even have to learn medicine in case anything goes wrong. American candidates for the ISS also have to learn fluent Russian so they're able to effectively communicate with the Russian Mission Control Center. Other parts of their training include being placed into mock vessels to be able to experience what it will be like on their journey to the ISS. On NASA's KC-135 airplane, they're able to experience weightlessness for a short time right here on Earth and most of them don't react well to it at all. <laughs> Once they actually go into space, it gets even tougher. Their daily routines. While astronauts may seem like larger-than-life characters to most of us, at the end of the day, they're still humans with very human needs. Just like here on Earth, astronauts on the ISS need to eat, sleep, exercise, and even enjoy leisurely activities. However, even the most basic of tasks can be a challenge if you're on the International Space Station. When astronauts wake up in the morning, they too have a morning routine. Brushing your teeth is almost exactly the same as it would be on Earth, and toothpaste is actually space-friendly. However, when it comes to cleaning themselves, things can get rather difficult. They can't ever really take a bath or use normal shampoo. Most astronauts have a cleaning kit for those purposes. They use a special rinseless shampoo that was initially made for sick hospital patients who couldn't look after themselves. Perhaps the most difficult part of an astronaut's daily routine is simply going to the bathroom. They have a toilet, but due to weightlessness, they can't just sit on it. They need to be strapped into a toilet with leg restraints, which doesn't really give you a chance to secure yourself in case of an emergency. The toilet itself is more like a vacuum cleaner attached to their behinds that suck all the air and waste into them and the space urinal does more or less the same thing. And finally, at the end of the day, astronauts have to sleep. While astronauts can technically sleep in pretty much any position they want, in most cases they buckle themselves up inside a sleeping bag either vertically or horizontally, so they don't just float around and bump into things all night. Some astronauts reported that they experienced more nightmares while in space, while others reported that they began to snore. Eating in space. On Earth, we're spoiled by all kinds of different foods. You can get delicious foods of all kinds delivered right to your house by just a few taps on your phone. Astronauts are very limited when it comes to what kind of food they can have and how much of it they can have. Generally, they can have foods like fruits and brownies in the same form they would on Earth. However, when it comes to other foods like, say, macaroni and cheese, those would usually come in a dry form that they would then add water to, making it palatable. Most foods in space are dried out and astronauts also have an oven they can use to warm up their food. However, there are no refrigerators in space, which can make storing food a challenge in and of itself. Astronauts even have salt and pepper but not in the same form we do on Earth. Normal salt and pepper wouldn't stick to the food in space. It would simply float away in weightlessness and could even be dangerous, as the salt and pepper particles could clog up the air vents in the cabins. This is why salt and pepper actually come in liquid form in space, and you would simply squeeze the liquid out of its bottle and sort of rub it on the food to season it. Most food in space comes in disposable packaging, which must be thrown away after use. The packaging prevents the food from floating around all over the place and creating a giant mess. Astronauts have to eat a lot more than we do on Earth. 
The typical male astronaut eats around 3,000 calories a day. Considering space food isn't exactly the most appealing of foods, that has to be quite a challenge itself. What do astronauts do in their free time? Technically, astronauts are working 24-7, but there are times when they have no tasks to do, and once the initial excitement of being in space is gone, it can actually get quite boring for some of the astronauts. Thankfully, there are more than a few ways astronauts can keep themselves entertained. Many astronauts have commented on their fascination with the gorgeous sunrises and sunsets that can be seen from the ISS. Sunrises and sunsets can be seen every 45 minutes from the ISS. Many astronauts simply pass their time by simply looking at their view of the Earth in awe. They try to find different locations on the real-life map they have right in front of them. Certain views of the Earth can be quite exciting, especially at night when they can see actual cities light up. They can probably see their houses from up there. Watching movies is also a really common way to spend time in space. While it may sound crazy to look at a screen where you can see literally the entire world outside your window, many astronauts need a break from reality and a movie or a TV show is usually the perfect way to do it. They also listen to music, read different books, and spend time with other astronauts looking to doze off for a while. Exercise is both a common way to pass time and an essential part of an astronaut's daily routine. Astronauts need to stay fit and work out at least once a day, and sometimes twice a day. Fun fact, exercising usually leads to astronauts forming floating blobs of sweat that fly around the cabin, which they then have to catch with a towel. I guess that could also count as entertainment when you have literally nothing else to do. Work in space. At the end of the day, astronauts are still employees of whatever space agency they're working for, and they have to do various different tasks almost every day as part of their life on the International Space Station, which at its core is a research facility. Work can actually be quite interesting as astronauts conduct various experiments in space. They almost never run out of experiments to carry out, and a lot of the knowledge we have of space comes from the experiments carried out by astronauts on the ISS. Some experiments may also be medical as doctors try to figure out how living in space affects their bodies. On the more boring side of things, astronauts constantly have to carry out maintenance work and repairs on their orbiting platforms. They have to update the computers, clean out the filters, fix the light bulbs and other things like that. They also have to stay in contact with Mission Control at all times. And that's a wrap for this video. If you enjoyed it, make sure to leave it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this one. See you in the next one.